Everybody's Talking, the theme song of Midnight Cowboy, was sung by Harry Nielsen, who died in January this year. And the Nielsen concert you're about to see now will throw a beam of light on the kind of magician Nielsen was in that happy London of the late 60s, early 70s, now gone. Harry had it all. Everything the Beatles had, he had, except a relationship with an audience, because he didn't play live, and that makes this studio concert very valuable. At the height of their fame in 1968, before Harry became well known, John and Paul told a press conference in New York that he was their favorite singer. He became a lifelong friend with all of the Beatles and a collaborator, and that helped him along a bit. But he would have made it anywhere, I think. He was a true genius of pop music, a one-off, his own man and all of that. Really, he was the Orson Welles of the music business, with an incredible understanding of the interior of popular song, how it worked, why it worked, and when. And he wrote with his heart and his head and his funny bone, and that set him apart from all the others. He never wrote a hit for himself, but he could write them for friends, and he could take other people's songs, like Fred Neal's Everybody's Talking, to the top. Without You, the number one, of course, was his biggest hit, and both those songs have been hits by other people this year in a sort of tribute. Harry was incredibly generous and famously, endlessly fun playful, witty, and when the moon was up, very, very wild. Above all, he loved wizardry, and there's plenty of that in the concert you're about to see, one of his very few public appearances. This is Nielsen at his most playful, so fill up, curl up, and roll up for a magic carpet ride. You're in for a real treat, a real trip. <laughs> 